on the ground. Tornado is now on the ground. Look at that funnel cloud, wow. It's hard to tell if it's touching the ground right now. Look at that, unbelievable. It's gonna pass right in front of us. passing right in front of us. I can't tell if it's in contact with the ground. There's a lot of rain. Can't see if there's any debris or not either. Getting a lot of inflow in where I am. I think that thing's in contact with the ground given the surface wind I'm experiencing here. We'll have to see if there's any corn down here. Uh, I'm about to cross where it just went. It's getting so rain wrapped now that it's hard to see. Okay, here's a bunch of other chasers up here. Down in the field there, right in front of me. You can see that circulation in the field. Just very weak tornado. Right in front of me here. It's becoming hard with the rain to see this tornado. Um, and I don't think that you could see the debris on this video uh, just because my windshield is so obscured right now with this rain. But you can see the funnel up here. Oh, there's more debris right there, right there, flying around. The tornado is just to our right. It's hitting this farm. You can see the, the funnel right here. Look at that debris flying around. See the debris in the field here. I'm not sure if my. There we go. You can see the tornado right there in the field. Right here next to me. Look at it chopping up the corn. Look at that. Look at that. We have an ongoing tornado and we're getting debris with this. Tornado is right next to us, you can see it here. Look at that debris. Look at that, it's hitting this farm. Right here. Look at that. Look at this. Look at that, right in the field there. You see it? We're only a couple hundred feet away. Wow. Tornado is on the ground as we speak. This is amazing. It's been on the ground for a little while now. 
and uh, we've seen debris with this. It looks to be a fairly weak tornado, but there's definitely been there's definitely been debris. Uh, it's it's hit a couple of farms. It didn't look like it did major damage, but it's been on the ground for a little bit, and uh, it's made an impact here. Look at that. I gotta be careful because the police are here. Uh, looks like it's starting to rope out now. Circulation still in that bean field. Uh, still making contact with the ground there. Debris lofting into the air. There's a tornado on the ground. I see debris. Tornado on the ground with debris. Tornado on the ground, lofting debris just east of Sycamore, Illinois. Look at that tornado, wow. We're not very far out from it, and it's pretty quiet where we are here. Eerily quiet. You can hear the tornado sirens going off in the distance. Now I can hear it. That debris lofting into the field right next to me. It's still making contact with the ground, but the rotation has become more diffuse and it looks like it's weakening. Look at that debris coming down. It's raining down right next to us here. Hard to see with the lighting, but uh, it's uh, leaves mostly that were lofted into the air. Whoa!
Might be touching down again. Right next to us here. Very strong winds. Definitely debris being thrown around here. It's hard to tell if there's any defined tornado in contact with the ground, but... Debris raining down here from the tornado that just lifted. These are mostly leaves. Um, I don't know if it did any damage um, because I wasn't close to it for most of its life cycle. Uh, it approached me right before it lifted. But there's still this light debris that has been lofted that's uh, getting dropped back down. And uh, I'm watching for the potential for this tornado to touch down one more time. Looks like this tornado might be about to touch down again. We're east of Sycamore, Illinois right now. You can see that funnel cloud spinning there. And it looks like it's about to do it. It's on the ground. There it is. Listen to that roar. Listen to that. You can see it lofting some debris there. Yeah, multiple vortices. Multiple vortices on that tornado. <laughs> tornado continues on the ground. Getting flanked by the rear flank down track here, so I'm just getting up ahead of this thing so we can continue to see the tornado. But man, before we got flanked, those were some pretty strong inflow winds when that thing first touched down. Still on the ground. And that is one beast of a wall cloud above it. Now we're back in the inflow sector here. I can feel an abrupt temperature change in the warm air. And look at that tornado on the ground. It looks like it's getting better organized now. Wow. Wow, look at that. Look at that tornado. See the rain wrapping around it now, obscuring it just a little bit. Wow. This is the fourth tornado of the day that I've seen. Amazing. Look at that. It's about a quarter mile to our north. 
see it just past that tree line. Okay, we're getting flanked here again. So I'm gonna pull forward. Stay ahead of that flanking downdraft. And all that rain and rain pool there. See the tornado there on the left. I want to make sure to stay out of its path. Oh, we're getting pretty close to it here. It's directly ahead of us in that field. You can see it. It's going to cross right in front of us. Wow, look at that wind. Right in front of us, look at that. Almost over us. Oh my goodness. Look at that wind. Wow. Amazing. Just passed right over us. Look at it in that field now. Wow. Unbelievable. I would say wind's maxed out where I am about 60 to 80 miles an hour. Follow this line of chasers here. Five, tornado number five just touched down. It may have lifted already. Right back here. Very strong winds where I am right now.